I am sorry to tell you that a lot of our fellow Australians avoid paying a fair share of income tax by hiding expenses, hiding incomes, overclaiming expenses, and even falsifying their tax return files. 56 millionaires paid no income tax in 2014 and again in 2015. These are only the cases that we know about. The true extent of tax avoidance could lead to billions of dollars in lost revenue every year. To collect these lost revenues, tax office must audit taxpayers like you and me. However, do they target the right people? Whistleblowers from the Australian Taxation Office revealed that they are targeting vulnerable low-income families and small businesses to get more taxes because these people have less power to fight back. We need to target these audits better. Thanks to the Australian Taxation Office, I'm able to study a valuable 2% alumnus tax files. I help identify potential tax avoiders using a unique digit analysis called Benford's Law. In 1938, Frank Benford identified a curious pattern, the black line in the graph, that reoccurred in natural data set. From street addresses to death rate, electricity bills, and even length of rivers, numbers do follow Benford's Law. If the numbers do not follow this pattern, it is likely that fake data has been introduced. Based on a detailed analysis of over 170,000 actual tax files, my results suggest that Benford's Law can indicate potential groups of tax avoiders. For example, the red line shows that the group of taxpayers who paid very little income tax based on their income level has a noticeable high deviation from Benford's law, while others follow it closely. Using my method, we can examine the numbers in all the tax files within only a few hours and identify a whole group of potential tax avoiders. This can help the Australian Taxation Office to fairly and efficiently target its audits. So hopefully one day, not only you and me, but everyone in Australia will pay its fair share of income tax. Thank you.